Break the language barrier. No matter what language you speak, most of the world speaks a different one. The Translate feature in Office 2019 is available for Word, Excel and PowerPoint. Just go to the Review tab and select to translate the entire document or a selection. Select the language to translate to. In this instance, I'm going to select French and click Translate. Insert icons in Microsoft Office. Easily insert icons and scalable vector graphic files into your Office documents, workbooks, emails and presentations. Insert icons from the Insert tab. Icons are categorised so you can scroll through, find your selection and click Insert. Once in place, you can rotate, colour and resize them with no loss of image quality. I'm going to adjust the size of mine and I'm going to move it to a different position by dragging and dropping. Further options for formatting are available on the Graphics Tools Contextual Ribbon. For example, I could change the colour. Use the Morph Transition in PowerPoint. The Morph Transition allows you to animate smooth movement from one slide to the next. To use the Morph Transition effectively, you'll need to duplicate the slide and then move the object on the second slide to a different place or copy and paste the object from one slide and add it to the next. Once you've placed your objects in their new position, you can apply the Morph Transition from the Transitions ribbon. This will animate your slide. Get creative with 3D models. Word, Excel and PowerPoint support inserting 3D models directly into your documents, workbooks and presentations to illustrate a point. Insert 3D models from the Insert tab. Scroll through, select your model and click Insert. You can rotate models 360 degrees or tilt up and down to show a specific feature of an object. 3D models can be resized and formatted much like any other object using the contextual ribbons. Find what you're looking for with Zoom. If you'd like to make your presentations more dynamic and exciting, try using Zoom for PowerPoint. Click the Zoom drop-down and select Slide Zoom. We're going to select Slide 6 and add it to our slide. We can resize the thumbnail if required. Now when we click Slideshow and click on our thumbnail, it will zoom directly to that slide. Alternatively, from the Insert ribbon, we can select Zoom and Summary Zoom. This will allow us to select multiple slides. I'm going to select slides 6, 7, 8 and 9 and click Insert. It will create a summary page with our thumbnails. I'm going to add a quick title and then when I run my slideshow, I can click on any of the thumbnails to zoom to that particular slide. Draw and write with ink in Office. On a touch-enabled device, draw with your finger, a digital pen or a mouse. If you can't see the Draw tab, go to File, Options and Customize Ribbon and place a tick next to the Draw ribbon. Click on the Draw ribbon and select a pen. You can highlight or make annotations on your document. Undo any mistakes using the Eraser tool.
select another pen and click on the Ink to Shape button. Ink to Shape will allow you to take a freehand annotation and convert it to a shape which can then be resized, moved and formatted like any object. Helpful sounds improve accessibility. The accessibility checker is better than ever with updated support for international standards and handy recommendations to make your documents more accessible. Run the accessibility checker before sending out any emails or documents to make sure your content is easy for people of all abilities to read. Sound effects can enhance your productivity in Microsoft Office by providing audio cues. I'm going to select Modern and click on OK. A cue might notify when options on the screen change, or a sound can confirm that an action has been performed, such as sending a mail, deleting something, or pasting content. New chart types in Excel. You can create a map chart to compare values and show categories across geographical regions. Use it when you have geographical regions in your data, like countries, states, counties or postal codes. Recommended charts will also pick up the map chart type, making it even quicker to insert. The waterfall and funnel charts are also new for Excel 2019.